happy day. I'm just a human. I'm addicted to pranky danks. I'm addicted to watching the things that would make me so mad if it happened to me. For example, this would make me want to slay the entire human race, like putting ketchup in her brush. And by the way, there is absolutely no hair in this brush. Like if you saw what my brush looked like, like it's disgusting. So this is a girl who takes good care of herself and her stuff. This is, uh, oh, she's blow drying her hair. She just showered. It's not good. It's not good. <laughs> Same. Same. Like uh, that's not good because I shower when I'm like, okay, it's time to relax. It's time to shampoo, condition, shave, exfoliate. Like when I shower, it's a whole situation. I don't take like a bunch of short showers. I take like one or two long showers. So I would be devastated if this happened to me, especially because my hair takes so long to dry and having to shampoo it again, when you already shampooed, your scalp's gonna get dry. The whole thing is a disaster. How rude. <laughs> Why would you say that? It's just rude. Oh no. This is how to get your mom to kill you. Drill a little hole in her candle, put what looks like a firecracker in it, I can't, I don't, I don't think I'd ever be able to look at a candle the same. Like that is a, this is a terrible, terrible thing to do to your mother. And she could have got hurt. You know, you're getting old and you're like, it's all fun and games until people get hurt. So many teachers have said that to me. People my age when I was in high school used to really like playing with Roman candles. And I always heard the old story of like the guy who blew off his fingers with one. And I wonder if teachers lied to us. They're designed to shoot flaming balls. Okay, well that doesn't seem safe. Roman candles caused 400 injuries in 2018, 200 of which affected the eye. Okay, so they weren't lying. Oh, the roach prank. Giving people. Got this for you, Matt. Who's there? A roach. Training <laughs> <laughs> me how to do TikTok. <laughs> He's so scared. He's so scared. Like, just these little minor. Like, like, you can tell that every single muscle in his body completely clenched up. His life flashed before his eyes. He was like, is this real? Is this fake? I can't, like the adrenaline that you are giving these people, it makes me feel like it's not worth the prank because that much of that much stress hormone in your body has got to last like several hours. I know that when I have like a really, really bad moment of adrenaline, like it actually impacts my sleep and I can't sleep for a really long time after. It's like drinking 10 cups of coffee for me. I'm like, <gasps> and it's, my whole day's ruined. What is okay, that guy just doesn't get scared at all. <laughs> oh, these little knee jerk reactions are so good. Here's one that doesn't hurt anybody. Pretend that you're tripping over something that isn't there and then get your friend to do it. Oh, I mean, a slightly different spot, but this guy, like it, it was enough. He's confused. He's so confused. <laughs> Oh my goodness, this would actually mess with me so badly. Like I would actually think I'm living in a simulation. Like he cannot compute. I wouldn't either. I'd be kind of worried about the person with the phone filming me though, but this guy doesn't seem to notice it. Oh my God, he's testing with the chair. He doesn't believe it. Oh my goodness. It's so funny because messing with somebody's sanity is so much meaner than like a lot of just practical jokes, but it's so funny. This is elaborate. Rating stranger shots. You throw a basketball at them and put up a net. Okay, that guy's not into it. This guy, no, okay, everybody's just swatting the basketball. She's just dodging it. I like to think that I would at least try, but I'd be so embarrassed because like these guys look like they play ball. Oh dear, come on. We gotta get at least one person who does it. Oh yeah, let's go. Let's go! <laughs> oh my God, that'd be so fun. That'd be so hype. When the ride operator pulls a seatbelt prank. That's just, this is mean, this is so mean. Telling this guy that his seatbelt is too loose and then making the ride go while he's fixing it. That's so mean because you're literally gonna pull muscles and, and like hurt your fingers from how hard you're about to grip the ride. Like he's gonna have a death grip. He's so scared! What is he doing? What is this? Is it like kind of awkward to not scream on a ride like this? Like I always feel like I'm screaming on rides like this because it's the normal thing to do, but I, like, Truthfully, I'd want to just sit there and just kind of 
This is going to a fast food restaurant, saying you ordered a small fry and they gave me a potato. And they gave me a potato? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> okay, at least she likes it. I was actually kind of worried. I'm gonna yell at whoever did that, whoever oh. made that, because I didn't, and all. <laughs> Oh, she nice. gets him a free one. I gave him a potato instead of french fries. He just ordered a small fry, but it's a whole potato. Like, it's not been cooked at all. Either. What the world? Just. <laughs> okay. okay. I'm just glad that they're all laughing. Like, and I hope that it was all like that and like positive because working at fast food can be a very stressful job. It can be a very thankless job. A lot of people treat fast food workers so badly. And if I ever meet anyone who does that, I'm going to kung fu them in the solar plex. But this seems to have been taken well, which is nice. That's scary. This is the old classic pillow prank. <laughs> Throw a pillow at your girlfriend. What the Pretend you didn't do anything and then get somebody on the other oh side to keep throwing it Doma. so someone else gets Doma. the blame. I love pranks where you are the perpetrator, okay? You're the person who did them dirty. This guy did her dirty, but you kind of do a little reverse, so it looks like you both are like, who did that? I know it's the simplest prank ever, but like just tapping someone on the shoulder, and then when they turn around, like you're also looking for the person. For me, that's like comedy gold. I just like spat so much when I said that. I was like, for me, that's like comedy gold. I don't know why I did that. Okay, that's Now, if you really miss good. this one, I'm not gonna talk to you for a whole week. They're trying to make a video where he gets both trick shots and he just purposely throws. That's just mean. That's just frustrating. Then you're gonna have to be there for another six hours. Like, that, that's, that hurts. That hurts me. This is too far. Go to Red Lobster and order lobster. Then when it comes, switch it with a live one. I don't know about this, guys. Are the, the claws don't even look elastic. Stop, they're not. What if the server gets hurt? Yeah. Oh, the manager's lying to help save face for his staff. Yeah, yeah, they're gonna cook it. Thank you so much. No way. I don't know about that. I don't know. I don't know how that makes me feel. On the bright side, you're like saving the restaurant money by bringing them a lobster to cook, but the other lobster already hit the table, so it's a waste. I hope you pay double. I really do. Okay, wait. What is this? Are you ready? No! What do you mean no? No! I mean Three, no! Two, Joe, I said no! Five. I said no! Joe, I said no! Joe, no, I said no! Girl, it's just a garbage bag. Kick your way out of it. You could get hurt! This is dangerous! Oh no! Why would he run away? Is this even a prank? This is just like too far. Oh no! This is like messing with mom's candle expert level. This is like making me want to hide. Uh-uh. Uh-uh! This is how people get fireworks in their eyes! Fake windows update on my boss. Oh, this is this would be a smart way to like get out of work. Just like open up an update that makes your boss just sit there for the rest of the day. It's been 30 minutes. It's a shame you posted this on TikTok. She's probably gonna find out. She's so mad. She's really calling the IT guy. Um, 24 years <laughs> later. Oh. Oh, she's not even laughing. <laughs> oh my gosh, she's not even laughing. Run! When you're both mad at each other and petty AF. Oh. So he laid his edges and used all of her product. She's drinking the soy sauce. Okay, I mean, that that's two L's for you. I, I don't like that. I don't like that. <laughs> drinking soy sauce, like that was like the light green, so that was the low sodium soy sauce, but even still, like a couple tablespoons of that and you're just... Ugh. Your blood pressure through the roof. My auntie's birthday was last week, <gasps> and I told oh my her that God. her gift finally came. I put it in a bag to look uh -uh. fancy. Uh-uh. No, She's gonna fall down and crack her head. I'm so concerned right now. It's like inside of the box. Oh, open this up like yeah. this. Damn! Oh my god. Why you do that story? I hate jokes where like someone plays a joke on me and they're laughing and I don't think it's funny. Especially ones where like I get hurt or like I stump my toe like trying to escape or something. It's very upsetting and then the person's just laughing at me and I'm like, why are you like having fun by yourself? We're supposed to have fun together. Pretend it to be the prank. Oh no. <laughs> no. 
Uh uh. I don't even know what I do. I don't even know what I do. You got your friend in the pool with the Kool Aid. Jojo, don't play with me. Yo, guys. Jojo, Jojo. Okay, so I don't know if I believe it based on the way he dived in the pool. Would you go eyes, nose, mouth straight into your friend's blood? I don't know if I could. Like, I'd just jump in feet first. Go, go! Oh my goodness, that's so mean. That is so mean, uh, but I love it. I hope it's real, because that's, I mean, I also don't hope it's real because this guy probably isn't gonna sleep, but at the same time, it's pretty funny. Making my husband think he shrunk my clothes. Babe, can you put the clothes in the dryer for me? This is a really good idea. Boy, they stink. <laughs> okay, rushing him. So innocent. Replacing the clothes with Barbie doll clothes. That is, this is such a oh. smart, and funny idea. Action. What's in the dryer? <laughs> Does it work? <laughs> what did you do? That's so good. That's so good. What a good couple. That's sweet. That's this is what I need. I, I needed that after those pranks that were just way too far. He hates this okay. sound. <laughs> oh, <fuck. laughs> I, uh, I hate that sound too. I hate. I don't know. I, I didn't realize I hated that sound so bad. <laughs> oh, wow. uh, okay. I, I can't do it. I can't do it either. I'm with this guy. Oh, I'm just like thinking about the fact that he's brushing his teeth. Okay, one sec. I actually like. I I need. I need. A... That's bad. That's really really bad. That's a hor. That's a terrible thing to do to somebody. Well, guys, that is all I have for you today. Please check out the creators who featured in this video. I hope you enjoyed this video. And if you'd like to see me again, make sure you hit push notifications. I'll see you on the next one. Bye.